Good afternoon, Benton teachers. It's time for PD video number three, or episode number three, whatever you want to call it. So let's get started. We have just a few things to talk about. So you should have your certificates in your certificate folder. You should have your certificates written into that log piece. So now we're going to talk about that um, post workshop form, or the or your highly qualified form, and then we're just going to talk just briefly about that passion project. Okay. All right, here we go. So remember to get into your um, PD log. You're gonna go into STAR. Remember we did that at the very beginning of the year and it was very helpful for us. You are going to look for the folder that has your last name, first name, and then the year. Okay, I'm gonna click right here. Okay, now we're gonna do highly qualified first because that's what I am, okay? So under highly qualified, okay, now for most of you, I think I put the, your, your name, Benton, school year, and your assignment. So what you need to fill out is this first part right here. It says how many professional development hours for this year. What you're gonna have to do is go back. Okay. So I was doing a lot at one time. And then look at that log real quick. Okay. And then right here by the yellow, it says it would be calculated for you this year, which is amazing. And you can see I have 36.5. So if I go back into my highly qualified form, okay, I'm just going to put that 36.5 right here. Okay. Now, if I scroll down, so part one, part one is that it's highly qualified professional development. What I need you to do is just put an X by part one, okay? Then part two and three, I need you to think about back to all that PD you did and kind of where does it fit, okay? I did some grade level work. I did some content level work. I did some specialty area work. I did some action research, some things. Um, and then it was content-based, instructional-based, research-based, okay? Um, just think about the ones that you've taken and what you've done. And then you need to have all of part one with X's, at least one X in part two, and one X in part three. Okay. Now, give me a second. I'm going to go into a blank um, post-workshop sheet. Now, yours should look very similar. Um, again, your name goes here, school year goes here, your grade level goes right here, um, or it can go underneath either one, the year, and then your total PED hours right here, okay? Again, it's very, very similar. You just need to put an X by all of part one, at least one X by part two, and one X by part three, okay? The very last thing we need to talk about, and we'll go back into mine. Okay. The very last thing we need to talk about is that passion project. Okay. So inside your folder, at the very beginning of the year, you should have done your passion project. Okay. So it should have some, your statements here about what you were going to do and everything else and your action statements. And what I need you to do is just do a little bit of a reflect piece. That's step five. Um, even if it's just a sentence of, we are planning to continue this passion project through next year, um, or some of the, just, just a sentence or two, uh, we know they're not a priority, just, we just would like to wrap up the year, especially those of you that are not planning to come back to Benton. It's kind of important that you just kind of give me a sentence or two of reflection about that project, because your passion project probably should change for the following year. Okay. Once you have all that done, you have your certificates in your certificate folder, you have your log filled out, you have your post-workshop or highly qualified form filled out, and you have that just a sentence or two on that reflect of that passion project, your PD is done. Email it to me and I will email you back and I say, I'll say you're good to go and I will highlight your folder on my side of things, at least in green. That way I can know that you are completed. All right, it's due by next Monday. 
So if there's any way, there's a bunch of you and I love you all, but it takes a little while to, ch to check every single person's um, PD folder. So you got Monday. If there's any way you can get it done by like Saturday night at midnight, so that I can at least have almost a Sunday to check and email you back that it's finished, that would be wonderful and I would appreciate it very much. Anyway, I love you all. I'm missing you all and I hope you're gonna have a great week. All right, bye guys.